Mega cringe zone. Quite possibly the most wholesome content on YouTube. Okay, this is about as big as they can be. You don't see these kinds of angles on the capybara moving the counts. The fog's already come for Big Al. Look how close <laughs> I'm standing to him. Oh, Kevin, would you like to eat Big Al? He tries to bite me like that. Now he gets to hang out with the babe. Waddle into the pond. Oh, this isn't safe for your diabetes at all. Good morning again, everybody. I got the nasty rug out of my kitchen. Look at that. And look at these little babies just sleeping in this blanket. I threw this blanket in here last night, and this one just kind of curled up and whoa god are you pooping in the food no he just sitting in it but look at this you guys it's a cloudy day the first cloudy day we've had in ages and to celebrate i'm taking big ounce for a walk around the property go ahead let it out buddy let it out let it out buddy let it out. there it is wow look at this you guys green grass on the property again all these holes are gonna get filled in really soon by the way but this is a direct answer to prayer you guys the rat tights are very very happy as you can see look at them they've even separated themselves based on race and gender but now there's plants growing in here again you guys even the green stuff in here is growing in and that's all food for them this was all brown less than a week ago kevin is still no longer aggressive i think that he thinks that remington is his mate and he's protecting remington oh how the tables have turned <laughs> oh, just kidding he's aggressive again here kevin would you like to eat big ounce no even kevin fears big ounce look at all the ducks over there just waddle into the pond he's starving we need to put him in this bucket of sweet feed now just kidding you don't need any more diabetes i guess the wind knocked apart my fire pit kevin you have to share with remington i think kevin's gonna run away once i come up on him like this wow he's not look how close i'm standing to him oh now there's a little bit of food for you remington here you go big ounce eats an adult turkey big ounce devours our pardon turkey big ounce posted up vibing with the turkey and the geese coming to watch big ounce eats our geese those geese did not care for this little man they were so scared of him and i I really don't blame him. Look at this man. Man, he really scared them away from the food. All right, come on, son. Let's go. This man got so excited that I was showing him a field that he bit me because he wanted me to let him down. And it wasn't a bad bite, but as far as big ounce bites go, that was pretty bad. This is a big step up from being inside or in his little kennel. And look, now he gets to hang out with the baby. Oh the baby it's okay he's friend he's a friend to baby hey it's okay he's just a little man this cured my depression kiss him back kiss him back to baby no you're being cringe the baby you don't know what kind of danger you're in now he's gonna eat you him getting out through here is an accident waiting to happen oh it happened oh all right guys big ounce is gone we are not going to find him again is it worth it to let him run out and play for a little bit yeah. Cool thing I think though is that when I walk away, he'll follow me. Come here, buddy. Yeah, see, he follows me. I like to let him run out on a nice day like today and have a little bit of socialization with the other animals. It's also fun to see just how fast he can go, but this is all food for him. See how he just comes right back to Papa. Speaking of Papa to baby, you're my son. Thanks for coming out here today. You're very handsome and cute. I love you and I appreciate you. It's a beautiful little forehead you have there, sir. How's about I give you a little boop, poke you in the nose, boop. Give me a nice, good sniff. Thank you, sir. Look how big his tail is now. All right, son. Don't don't go running off too far now. But look at all this grass that grew back in the last four days alone from it raining every day, you guys. This is insane. It's crazy how quick things can change up in Texas. I'm kind of afraid to pick him up now because I think he's just going to bite me again. She's like, no, this is the one time I get. My friend scattered a ton of seed around the property so that we would get some doves. I don't know if you should be eating those though, boy. So here, I'm going to scratch your head. This is what I realized. If you don't want him to bite you, just scratch his face like this. And then he'll be too happy to bite you. Even if he really wants to stay out here and have fun fun and he's willing to bite you to stay if you scratch him like this he'll be like oh hey, never mind look at this man this is what happens i pick him up and he goes no 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 oh and then he tries to bite me like that look at that i'm gonna put him in a bucket thankfully i left this kennel out here because i'm not trying to get bit i'm also not gonna leave him out here this boy would get annihilated by a hawk in two seconds and we have plenty of them here gonna keep an eye on him but first i'm gonna check the back of the property he's back there see? pretty soon i'm gonna have all this stuff cut down this is just sapling mesquite trees and some other weeds whoa is that a prairie to whoa is that hit rapper an artist get over here good morning mr DeBaby, hit rapper from cleveland how are you today your feet look very healthy today mind if i get a couple pictures sir the baby please let me photograph your feet it's for my log it's for my blog sir on youtube big ounce you went and scared away the only hit rapper in this town now that we don't have any clout you're gonna have to go in the mega cringe zone that's right the mega cringe zone sir just for you actually left this kennel over there don't worry the baby i've locked up this deviant there go the ducks swimming in my nasty algae pond but it is a pond nonetheless <laughs> pretty soon we're gonna have a filtration system and a little fountain 
here and then we're gonna have a small fountain up there and it's gonna roll down into here. It's gonna be very nice. But look how happy they are. And the high for today is 80 degrees, you guys. Well, high 80s, but still. The big ounce boy has returned. Oh, you guys may be thinking, oh, whatever, Uncle Ben, we don't care about your rain and your green grass. But this is something Uncle Ben's been praying for for like three months now. Literally three months. Look at him run right in there to the food. I should probably close it so he doesn't eat it all. Oh, that's nice. This is why we can't have anything nice in this house. But that's okay because today I wanted to show you guys something really special. We are celebrating by feeding only the green part of this pineapple to these bad boys. Watch and be amazed as they love only the green part of the pineapple. Also, these guys are finally starting to shed a tiny bit. So I'm going to go ahead and get an outdoor enclosure set up for them. But once winter rolls around, I'm going to bring them back inside and I'm going to keep them in the barn sometime. Wow. Take a look at this, you guys. This will also be on the ASMR video that we're going to make pretty soon. We're going to have a silent video of just them chewing for like an hour long. It will be the best ASMR ever made objectively. Yeah, you bet you don't see this on the Capybara meme accounts, do you? You don't see these kinds of angles on the Capybara meme accounts, huh? <laughs> They'll never have this kind of content unless they... St and Unless they steal it. Far be it from the kind capybara channels to take my content and make memes out of them. But look at this. They only eat the green part and they annihilate it. Also, these aren't underwear. These are shorts. They have pockets. Wow. Don't mind if I do. Oh, sweet. Wampum. <laughs> oh, this is phenomenal content. Don't you agree? <laughs> this man really got both hands on me doing this. Look at their little bums. They're so precious. This man kind of thick. Now, me personally, I would only eat this part of the pineapple, but I guess they enjoy the top part as well. Kind of cringe, Gort, not gonna lie. But what else should I expect from a cringe little man such as yourself? Isn't this just the darndest thing? Perfect ASMR for my little tiny ears. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and check on the ostriches real quick to see if they're doing okay. Don't eat too much of that now, son. By the time I get back, this is probably gonna be gone. Oh, this isn't safe for your diabetes at all, sir. He is getting real snippy with me, you guys. He tried to bite me twice so now i'm just gonna grab his face and smush it look how he just turns on his back like this how about you stop chewing up my couch how about you stop being real cringe and chewing up my couch and eating every animal on my farm oh he is a low cut what's that from oh it's probably from trying to chew out of the cage he's like no you took my only food now i'm gonna starve but yeah guys the porch is now neat and clean There's no more kennels here i rehomed the little tiny baby karens to a partner of ours i also rehomed the tegu to him here's some footage i got of us moving these guys over into this enclosure okay this is about as big as they can be without them getting hurt if you hold them like this or you getting hurt i'm a 200 pound man i'm six foot two and oh and this is really hard for me bear in mind guys this little ostrich chick is about four or five months old and he is already bigger than karen these boys ain't got no concept of personal space now none of the rat tights are really smart but the rias are the smartest i think the emus are the second smartest and the ostriches are the dumbest look at this guy trying to eat his feathers look at this everybody's curious about the big boy even the little Rhea. look at him who are you i am from ancient greece look at how these guys are just picking at him like that that's not okay this one i'm gonna try and walk over there because he's already got some issues with his legs Come on, buddy. Go around it. I'll try and walk him over there. It's my buddy's car. He might just pick up a rock and eat it if we're not careful. Yeah, yeah, he's already doing it. Come on, buddy. Get in there. Okay, he's heading over there. Almost there. Come on, son. You're almost there. <laughs> okay, now we're just going to kind of walk him over here. They're lovely. Just like sheep. Perfect. Matter of fact, he needs to eat little things like this so it can help him grind up food in his stomach. Kanye be like, don't mind if I do. <laughs> Name another turkey that'll let you do this to him, you guy. Mr. Pog is itching today. He's got terrible sarcoptic mange. Take a look at this. Just kidding, but he does have a little allergy that he's getting over. Look at this adorable little man. Here are the little baby Karens. They're going to be in great care with our buddy. He's going to give us updates on them as they grow. And here's Mark Zuckerberg. He's also going to be in amazing care. We're going to get updates on him as he grows. An ostrich with no thoughts head empty look at karen poking at this thing i also picked some grass for these boys take a look eat the grass oh they're about to hop hop here he comes he's gonna hop 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 wow look at how they jump down don't mind if i do this is quite possibly the most wholesome content on youtube right now officially all right guys that's actually it thanks so much for watching this video we love you we appreciate you and we'll see you in the next oh almost forgot to tell you again. Oh. oh i'm sorry were you about to leave without leaving a like a comment a subscribe and a pog for me after all the work i did for this video
Even after knowing that the fog is coming, it's coming rapidly. Fog's already come for Big Ounce. As you can see, he's being stepped on. Look at that. He doesn't even care. And look at this little man on cleanup, dude. I think because of all the animals Big Ounce has been consuming, he doesn't take fall damage anymore. Because he literally just fell from the top of this kennel thing here and just was fine. He immediately started eating. With each animal he consumes, he takes their power. 